Over the last few months, the contest billed as the longest certified foot race in the world has been held in New York City. After running nearly 5,000 kilometres over 50 days, a Canberran has just won the ultra marathon. Every visitor knows the best way to see a famous city is on foot, but not like this. The Sri Chinmoy Self Transcendence Race stretches 3,100 miles over 50 days. Competitors run around and around a single city block in Queens, New York. The runners try to log at least 60 miles per day in order to reach that distance of 3,100 miles in the 52 day allowed period. The course is just shy of one kilometre. If you were to run one lap a day, you would still be going 15 years later. You walk along a pavement, you think it's flat. Once you go along on it 50 times, you notice all the inclines, you notice the banking, <laughs> you notice the cracks. Susan Marshall is a New Zealander living in Canberra. She entered the race after following the philosophy of Indian race founder and spiritual leader Sri Chinmoy. Really just as a means of becoming a better person and being happy and experiencing life more. Day after day, she pounded the pavement in all conditions. We had um, a cyclone come through um, and the weather did catch me off guard a little bit. So I had two days where I'd, my mileage wasn't so high, but I actually enjoyed those days. This week, she completed the monumental task, the first woman across the line. Remarkably, there were no major injuries. She hopes her achievements can inspire others. I, I hope that people will, will accomplish their own dreams because these are the things that are going to build a more peaceful and beautiful world. Proving what can happen if you just keep putting one foot in front of the other. Jonathan Gould, ABC News.